In this video, we are going to go through some of the settings that you can adjust in Microsoft Teams. I previously did a video on setting up a meeting in Microsoft Teams. If you want to check out that video, I will link it here in this video. But in this video, we're going to go over some of the settings like setting up your microphone, your camera, your background, accessing participants and accessing the chat. Let's dive in. All right, let's take a look around the Teams interface and let's look at a few things. So first, let's look at setting up your speakers and microphone. So you will see up here the mic section. This is going to just simply put you on mute or turn your microphone on. To set the microphone that you would like, you're going to go to More. And then we're going to go to settings and then we're going to go to device settings. And here you will see that you have your device settings here. So here's my audio settings. So I can set what I want my speaker to be. I can set what I want my microphone to be. I can also choose any type of noise suppression. So do I want to try to suppress any um, background music or background noise, anything like that? Um, by default, it's just set to auto, but you can adjust those settings accordingly. And then when it comes to your video settings, so which camera you would like to use in Teams, you can decide whichever camera is connected to your device, whatever camera is connected to your computer. And then also you can decide if you want your image to be mirrored or not when you are using Microsoft Teams. Now let's take a look at different backgrounds that we can choose in Microsoft Teams. So if I go to the more actions section and if I choose background effects, I can choose what type of background I would like to have behind me when I'm in a Microsoft Teams meeting. Um, I have my camera off in Teams right now just so I'm able to do this recording, but you can choose none. So it's just going to show your normal background. You can have a blurred background or you can choose from one of these um, backgrounds that Microsoft provides as well. And then you can also preview what that is going to look like before actually applying that setting, or you can click apply and turn on the video since I have my video off here. Now, when you're in a Microsoft Teams meeting and you want to view the participants who are in the meeting, you're gonna to go to the people section. And if I click on people, then it's going to show me who is in this meeting and the participants that are here. So if there are people in the meeting, it's going to show it here. If there are people in the lobby, people waiting to join the meeting, it's going to show them in here as well. And now if I'm wanting to access the chat within my Teams meeting, I can come up here to chat and I will see the chat here. So here I can access any chats that have been happening in this meeting. If there's any transcripts or any recordings, I can access those here as well. And when I'm in a chat, I can just simply type a message. I can add attachments. I can add um, emoji if I like. I can add GIFs and I can add extensions to this chat here. So I'm able to add um, more than just text to a chat in Microsoft Teams. So that was just a quick run through of some of the settings that you have access to in Microsoft Teams. We talked about setting up our microphone, setting up our speaker, looking at our video and what type of backgrounds we can choose, as well as accessing participants and chat. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below, and I will catch you in the next video.